If you want to hear want to hear an inspiring word that will get you through your day. If you want to build your faith, your faith grow in God's grace. God's grace. To have a better connection with Jesus Christ. So tune in to Good God's Morning. Good God's Morning. Good God's Morning. Good God's Morning. Right, beloved, good God's morning to tell you. I pray all is well with you on this Friday. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's Friday. Friday, Friday, Friday. We're getting closer to Sunday, beloved. Ooh. Thank you, Jesus. Good God morning to all of y'all. Good morning. Good God's morning. Pastor Soto. Good God's morning. Brandy Thompson. Good God's morning, Mr. Little. Good God's morning, Kanita. Good God's morning to Ronnie, Miss uh, uh, Rack, Rack, Cap, Rackley, Ronnie. Amen. Rackley, Ronnie. All right. Good morning, Deacon Holmes. Good morning to you. Good God's morning, everybody. It's a beautiful day the Lord has made, and we will, we shall. Come on, say it with me. We are going to rejoice and be glad in it. Good morning, Michelle Satcher. Good morning. Good God's morning to you. So we're grateful this morning to be able to join with you this morning. As we see what the Lord says for us on this Friday. So let's pull it up, beloved. Let's pull it up. It says, bam. Ooh, my favorite. <clears throat> Second Chronicles 7 and verse 14. Second Chronicles 7 and verse 14. And it says, if my people mm, 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 who are called by my name would humble, somebody say humble, humble themselves and pray mm, and seek my face and then turn from their wicked ways. Then will I hear from heaven and forgive their sin and will heal their land. My God from Zion. Let me double screen this. I'm going to double screen this real quick for you. Praise God. Lord, there's that's just some, some things in here that, that, that Christ is just telling us, and we've been overlooking it. We've been doing the other stuff and haven't been doing what he has asked of us and said of us. And so let's look at it. He says, if my people, first of all, are you his children? That's the first question. Are you his or are you not? That is the first thing. Uh, that that's, that's the big thing of the matter. If you belong to God, then guess what? This is what you need to do. He says, first of all, I need you to recognize and to fully acknowledge if you are mine. And now, if you are acknowledging that you are mine, now let me tell you what you need to do in order to get the results that you want. Oh, <laughs> glory to God. He says, if my people, if you are one, and he said, listen, no, 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 let me fully explain to you. If my people who are called by my name, good morning, first lady. Who are called, Sister Perry. Good morning. He says, if you, if my people, he says, if my people. And then he said, let, let me clarify it just a little bit more. Those who are called by my name. Are you a child of God? Are you called by his name? When people see you, when people look at you, when they see you and they think about you, they do, they say, oh, that's a child of God. Huh? That's one of his. Huh? Do they? Come on, come on, come on now. Come, 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 come. All right. It's as if my people who are called by my name. Because see, sometimes we think we are gods and God is shaking his head like, I don't know you. We're going to be like them people, uh, like he said in the Bible, is that they come to him and we say, um, we say, he says, depart from me because I knew you not. Uh huh? Good morning, Cardwell. Good morning. Good morning. Uh huh? We gonna we, we we I don't want to be like that. So he he specifies if my people who are called by my name, those who are really my sons and daughters, when people look at you, they see the characteristics of uh, uh, me in you. Then he says, first of all, this is what you must do. First of all, humble yourself. Stop trying to act like you all this and all that and that you don't need me and that you don't, you don't, you, you, you got everything under control and this, that, and the third and la, 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 la. Go sit down somewhere and humble yourselves. 
Be submissive to me and what I'm telling you. Be submissive to, to what I'm asking you to do, even when you don't understand it. Be submissive. Be willing. Ah, good God Almighty. Humble yourselves. He says, and then you got to pray. Because ah, see, what happens when we humble ourselves? We are more acceptable to hearing what God is saying. It's not a conversation of God, da 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 da, and God, da 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 da, and God, I want, I want, 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 and God, I need, 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 need. No, it says God. As a humble person, we come before God and say, God, what do you want of me? Ooh, 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 ooh. Mm -mm -mm. God, what do you want of me? What is it that you require of me? What is it that that you need from me? I'm humbling myself before you, God. What is it? What is it that you need? What is it that you want me to do? That's what we, that's what he wants us to do. First, if we're called to him, we're called by him, people understand us and see us, and they say, oh yeah, that's a child of God. First of all, we got to humble ourselves, be submissive to him, and pray. So when I pray, I hear from him, and it's not all about me, but it's all about God. Ooh, seek his faith. Read your Bible. Read your Bible. Don't just take my word for it. Read your Bible. Seek his face. Fasting. You know, sit, just laying out before God. Just, just, just want, God, I just want more of you. I just need more of you. God, feel me. God, feel me. Lord, just feel me, Jesus. Huh? Seek his face. Seek what he, he wants from you. He didn't tell you right away. Stay there until you get the answer. Lord have mercy. And then he says, after you've gotten the answer from me, after you prayed and after you've humbled yourself, there are going to be some things that are going to cause you to turn. Ooh, you're not going to do a whole 360, beloved, because if you do a whole 360, you go in the same direction. But you're going to do a 180. You're going to turn from that. Because if you are humbling yourself and if you are seeking my face, if you are uh, praying, then you will hear from me about some of those things that I need you to change. Good God Almighty. Some of those things that I've recognized that are not right. Oh, oh. some of those things that I've, 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 I'm going to tell you that it needs to, you need to change this. You need to do this. I, I don't want you to do that. No, don't do that. No, uh, 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 no, uh, uh. We'll turn from our wicked ways. And then he says, this is the promise. After you've humbled yourself, if first of all, you acknowledge that you're mine. You're modest that you are the call of me. People look at you, they acknowledge it. Then, because see, sometimes we think we're godly and other people don't think that. That's the one time I think the opinions count. Because I, if you see God, if you don't see God in me and I'm right here, shout na 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 and, you know what I'm saying? And, and oh, and, and if you don't see God in me, then you, uh, there's something wrong. Hmm? I need to go back and reevaluate all, all of all of that, huh? So that's the one one time I think good opinion is other other people is it counts, okay? Now, if you hit child, you're called a child, you humble yourself, you pray and you seek God, and then you turn from those things that are not like Christ. God says, I'll hear from heaven. I'll hear from heaven. And I will heal the land. I'll forgive the sins and I'll heal the land. We need a healing. But everybody ain't praying. Everybody ain't humbling themselves. Everybody ain't seeking the Lord. Everybody who crying, Lord, 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 don't even know Jesus. Oh, oh. I'm going to need you to get a real relationship with the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Stop, stop trying to, you know, copy and be like everybody else. Oh, 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 I like her shot. I'm going to get her shot. No, baby, be real. Be authentic. If it ain't in you, it ain't in you. Get what God has for you and run with that. Understand that. Flow in that. Don't be trying to copy everybody else. And no, just do what God has for you and let that be. Okay? I'll heal the land. He said, I'll heal the land. You, you've been looking and you've been searching and you're trying to figure it out when it's going to happen, when it's going to... And God says, I'm waiting on you. Mm. He says, I'm waiting on you. I'm waiting on y'all. Y'all. Y'all need to get together. Glory. Hallelujah. Let's get it together, beloved. It's easy. Just, just be submissive. Humble yourselves. Okay? We, ain't got, we, don't, we don't have nothing to prove to nobody. We all in this 
journey called life. And our ultimate goal for everybody is to get to heaven. Listen, I got to tell you something. In case you didn't know, when I get at the pearly gates, he's not going to call me bishop. He's going to call me servant. Ooh, good God. He's going to say, well done, my thy good and faithful servant. You've been faithful over a few. Now you can enter in. We all are servants. My title don't mean nothing to God. I'm, I'm just a vessel. Huh? Huh? And the more more, the more title or, or, or rank, I should say, I get, the more responsibilities he put on me. But that still doesn't take away from me being his child, me being his servant. Oh, y'all ain't want to hear that this morning. Mm. Good God Almighty. Let's pray. Father, we thank you, Lord, for this is the day that you've made, and we rejoice and be glad in it. And Father, I pray this morning that you help us to, first of all, acknowledge and recognize and take on the characteristics of you as children of you, humbling ourselves to your will and not our will. Being submissive and having an ear to hear what you're saying and not wanting to do what we want to do, but God, do what you have asked us to do. God, I thank you for the communion this morning with our fellow brothers and sisters and you, oh God, that is telling us, God, just, just, just to humble ourselves and pray so that we can hear from you, seeking your face over and over again, not just one time, but every day, all day, being diligent in that. And God, once we hear from you, because we'll hear some things that probably we don't even want to hear. We'll hear some things, God, that we didn't even think was a problem. But God, once we hear that, I pray that we can humble ourselves so that we can turn from it. God, we thank you. Hallelujah. That you're calling us to be better. You're calling us to be greater. You're calling us to humble ourselves. You're calling us to seek your face even the more. You're calling us to turn from our wicked ways. You're calling us, God, to pray. Pray, 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 pray. Hallelujah. And we thank you, oh God, that you're still calling us. God, I ask you now that you just do what you need to do in our lives. Everybody that's on God, everybody that, that was on, or every God that everybody that, that'll be on, that'll watch this. God, have your way in our life. God, we are your people. We are your children. God, do what you want to do with us. Have thine own way. We are, you are the potter, oh God, and we are the clay. Mold us and make us into the things that you would have us to be. Have thine own way. Give us the heart, God, to seek you, to want you, to love you. Hallelujah. Humble us, God. Humble us, Lord. We thank you. We give you praise, God. It's in Jesus' name we pray. And the people of God said amen, amen, and amen. Well, beloved. Good guys, morning to all of you. Good morning, Lady Karen. I say good morning, First Lady. Good morning, Rachel Graham. Good morning, Minister Little. Good morning, Pastor Connie. Good morning, good guys, morning to you. Uh, good guys, morning, Shelly. Good guys, morning to you. Good guys, morning to you all. Good guys, morning to you. Good morning. I think I said Rachel Graham already. If I didn't, good guys, morning to you. Good guys, morning. Um, w. Fred Conwell, God bless you. Good guys, morning to you. Good guys, morning, Michelle Satcher. Good guys, morning, Sister Perry. Good guys, morning, Deacon Holmes. God bless you. Good guys, morning. Good guys, morning, Kanita. What's up? Good guys, morning, Rack Lee Ronnie. Good guys, morning to you. God bless you. God bless you this morning. Y'all have a good morning, Minister Ford. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good guys, morning to you. Good guys, morning to you. Y'all have a blessed and a beautiful day, okay? It's Friday, so let's get ready for Sunday. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. I'm ready to worship the Lord in spirit and truth. I'm ready to see my fellow brothers and sisters in the Lord. I am ready. I don't know about y'all, but I'm ready. I need a refill. <laughs> good God Almighty. Listen, y'all have a blessed and a beautiful day. And we will see y'all tomorrow, same time, same place, for another Good Guys Morning moment. Y'all have a good day. Good Guys Morning to you. If you want to hear, want to hear an inspiring word that will get you through your day. If you want to
want to build your faith, your faith. Grow in God's grace, God's grace. To have a better connection with Jesus Christ So tune in to Good God's Morning Good God's Morning Good God